Hey, what do you call an ape who works at a call center? A who ring it hand. <laughs> hey there creators, Neif here, and today I'm doing another my favorite animal. This time it's an orangutan. <laughs> Yay! Um, I did this with uh, pan pastels and colored pencils. And uh, the reference photo is from Paint My Photo, um, and I've l left a link to that in the description. Um, so look be below, and um, yeah, let's get started. Hi everyone. So this is the fifth installment of the My Favorite Animal series. Um, for these, I'm going to do a piece of artwork for my top 10 favorite animals, starting at number 10. And today is my number five favorite animal, orangutans. So I will be, uh, I will have each of these available on my Etsy shop. The link is in the description. And 30% of the costs of the paintings will be donated to the World Wildlife Federation. Uh, if you'd rather have a print, those are also available on my Redbubble. And again, the link is in the description. So, let's learn about orangutans. Orangutans are great apes, a grouping that includes gorillas, chimpanzees, bonobos, and humans. Um, and they are the only great apes found in Asia. They are native to the rainforests of Sumatra and uh, Borneo. The word orangutan um, comes from the Malay language and means person of the forest. It's quite coincidental that the orang part uh, sounds so similar to the English uh, color orange, uh, especially since orangutans have their signature long orange hair all over their bodies. Um, on average, a female orangutan grows to be about 45 inches tall, whereas a male typically reaches an average of 54 inches tall. Amazingly, uh, due to the fact that orangutans spend most of their time in trees, their arm length is quite long, with the average arm span of a male orangutan reaching a whopping seven feet from fingertip to fingertip. are less social than other apes. They prefer to spend most of their time alone, um, but are known on occasion to interact with other orang orangutans. Um, that said, it's less common for male orangutans to hang out with other male orangutans, um, as they can be territorial and aggressive with each other if they suspect competition for mating. Male orangutans have a throat sac that they use to make long mating calls to females. These long calls can be heard about two kilometers away. 
the mating practices uh, essentially follow an availability of food. Orangutans will come together when there's food around, and when orangutans congregate, they mate. <laughs> Males reach maturity at about age 15 years, um, but they don't develop the puffy cheeks for which they're known for uh, until after maturation. Um, some males don't uh, develop them at all if uh, another m more dominant male is around during the, uh, that time um, that they would form. Males that don't grow these puffy cheeks are known as unflanged males. An unflanged male is still fertile though. Uh, while flanged males uh, get their mates through their long calls, unflanged males find their mates randomly while they travel. A female orangutan is less likely uh, to willingly mate with an unflanged male though, so unflanged males are known for forcing copulation with any female they encounter. Orangutans become fertile between the ages of 5 and 11, depending on their body fat. The more body fat they have, um, that means the more food they uh, have uh, to eat, the earlier they will start ovulating. Um, like humans, orangutan pregnancies last about 9 months, which is longer than any other great ape. Also like humans, orangutan offspring are called infants or babies, and they stay with their mothers the longest out of all other great apes, besides humans of course. A baby orangutan will stay with their mother until they are about 7 years old. A female will not become pregnant again until after her baby has long left the mother. Um, typically there are about 8 years between pregnancies. diet varies greatly from month to month. They are expert foragers and will basically eat whatever they have access to, typically favoring sugary and fatty pulp plants like ficus fruits. Bornean orangutans consume at least 317 different food items that include young leaves, shoots, bark, insects, honey, and bird eggs. Sumatran orangutans, however, have a bit more of a carnivorous appetite and are known for eating slow lorises, a small nocturnal primate.
Orangutans are sadly considered critically endangered, and ex extinction in the wild is likely to happen as soon as 10 years from now. The Sumatran and Bornean orangutans' uh, rainforest habitats are disappearing at an alarming rate due to deforestation and clearing of the land for pulp paper and palm oil plantations, with the remaining forests uh, degraded by drought and forest fires. Palm oil plantations often replace tropical forests, killing endangered species, uprooting local communities, and contributing to the release of climate warming gases. The, the orangutans are displaced, um, starved to death, are killed by plantation workers as pests, or die in the fires. Not only that, but orangutan infants are often poached for their meat, and the mothers are often killed so that they can get to the infants. Thankfully, the, uh, excuse me while I try to pronounce this, <laughs> the Bukit uh, Tikapula Sumatran Orangutan Reintroduction Project, which is the only reintroduction site for critically endangered Sumatran orangutans, has rehabilitated over 150 orangutans and released them back into the wild. There are also other orangutan uh, protection groups, including the Bornean Orangutan Survival Foundation, the Orang Yutan Republic, the Orangutan Project, and other organizations. Well, that is all the information on orangutans that I have for you right now. I hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> um, this painting was done with um, uh, pan pastels and um, polychromos uh, colored pencils on sanded paper. And the uh, reference photo for this was from Paint My Photo, which I'll leave a link down in the description below. So, uh, I do apologize that I haven't been very consistent with uploads lately. Um, I ended up getting the flu really bad and had to go to urgent care. Uh, the flu lasted for two weeks and it was just awful. Um, hopefully I am 
done with all these colds and flus for the year. Goodness. Anyway, so <laughs> thank you so much for sticking around. If you like what you see and you want to see more, uh, click that subscribe button and that bell notification icon. Stay tuned for the number four favorite animal. Later, creators. Bye.